What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm gonna to show you how to acquire Wurtz leg during the darkening of Trissom event. Let's get right into it and everything that you need to know how to do. Okay, so to acquire Wurtz, Wurtz leg, it takes a big sequence of things you have to do in order and we're gonna break all these things down. I'm gonna show you how to do it all. So the first thing that you need to do is, let me go to town, let me back back out of here. So the first thing that you need to do is go to your map, go to old the old ruins inside of Tristram in Act 1, and you'll see the little darkening of Tristram uh, symbol on the ground. You're going to go to the old ruins, right? You're already here. And I bring up my map, and you're just going to come down and look for the portal to Tristram, which will bring you in to the old, awesome, retro-style darkening of Tristram. Okay, the first thing that we have to get, guys, is the rotten mushrooms, which are going to be located on level 9 of the labyrinth. They are going to look just like the uh, black mushrooms that you'd look for in the original aspect of how to get, you know, the, the Staff of Hurting. So we're gonna go find those right now. We have hit level nine and all we're gonna do is look for the mushrooms on the ground. They're gonna be in a pile all next to each other and they could be located anyway, anywhere here, <clears throat> excuse me, on level nine. So make sure you check every single nook and cranny. Check everywhere. We were wrapped right around the corner, guys. It wasn't very far in to uh, level nine and then here is the black mushrooms. All you're gonna do is click on them and they're gonna drop the rotten mushroom which is the first item you need to acquire Wart's leg. After acquiring the rotten mushroom, we have to go back to town and we have to go through a sequence of events to get the rest of the pieces. And we have to do them in the right order. If you mess up, you do have to leave the game and try it all over again. You know, so do, please don't mess up this order. Just follow me um, right on the screen. So what you have to do is you have to take the black mushroom and throughout this normal town, you see all these bodies, Pippin, right? You see all these bodies, uh, Farnhams. We're gonna be going through all of these bodies, but first what we have to do is we have to locate uh, Arya's um, cauldron, okay? That cauldron is gonna be right over here as soon as I can find it because I'm really bad at trying to show you guys this stuff. So please don't judge me. It should be in one of these houses. Uh, I suck. All right, guys. So you're going to come all the way around to this spot on the map. Do not hit these three cows. Please do not touch them. They're going to be later in the order. But we're going to go right into this hut for the cauldron. And this is what we're going to do. This is Audrey, our, Audrey's calling. This is Adria's cauldron. I'm so bad at that. And all we're going to do is click it and we're going to get the witch's brew. So now what we're going to do is we're going to take the witch's brew and there's a strange connect. Uh, what was that? There's a strange cone that is sleeping. I don't even know what that is. Concoction. There's a strange concoction that has been sleeping for several years now. So we have to take this item and go through those bodies. So the first thing that we need to do is head right back over and we're going to go to the very first body. So follow me around. First body that we're going to take this to is Farnham's, which is going to be south of the portal. Okay, guys? So we got Pep in there. We're going to go south. We have Farnham's corpse. All you can do is going to click him. He's going to give you the drunkard's debt. Now, the drunkard's debt is going to go to Ogden, which is going to be back north past the portal right here to Ogden's corpse. Click him, we're gonna get Gardra's letter. We're gonna take that and we're gonna go down to Pepin's corpse. He's gonna drop us the healer's prescription. And if you want, guys, you can look at these items as you get them. The healer's prescription, Pepin details schematics for a child's wooden leg. Now, who would want that? I think we know who it'd be. Griswold is gonna be the one we're gonna take that to. Boom, he's gonna give us the plan for the Wurtz leg. Easy peasy. Now, after that, we're going to go back to town and go to the blacksmith. All right, guys, we're back in town. We have our plan for the Wurtz leg. Congratulations. You are completing the Wurtz leg. We're going to go to the blacksmith. We're going to right click and teach him. Now, the weapon is going to be found under Mace's Wurtz leg right here. It does cost a bajillion million to craft and then some regular reusable parts, but you should have plenty of those. So we're going to go ahead and craft it. Congratulations. Piss over here. We have Wurtz leg it is absolutely fantastic it's a phenomenal very low crappy weapon but it is really cool to have and you can craft it anytime you want now here's the trick guys when you're going in you just want to salvage absolutely everything salvage it all i can't believe i just did that but it is a key piece inside of this entire thing because we're going to get a, a pet for Wurt's leg when you craft or when you uh 
salvage Wurt's leg, he's gonna drop you the map of the stars. You probably weren't supposed to find this old map, but it appears to have a hook print stamped on it and the numbers 213. So remember those cows I told you not to touch? Now we're gonna go mess with those cows. We're gonna do a little cow tipping. Let's go. Once we are back into the darkening of Tristram, you're gonna go back to Ardria's house right here on the map, guys, and we're gonna go up to these cows. Now remember what it said, right? It said 213. So you're gonna read these from left to right. We're gonna go in order. Cow two, cow one, right? Cow one, and then cow three, and boom. We hit them all correctly. It's gonna open the abandoned farmstead. Let's go check that out. So inside the abandoned farmstead, this is gonna be a nice little like cow level. These cows you cannot kill, but what you're gonna to wanna to do is come all the way over here for Wurtz stash, an absolute stash of Wurtz. He's got all kinds of goodies in here, so we're gonna pop this. And they're gonna drop you the Royal Calf Pet. This is a count bound, this is the Royal Calf, and that is how you complete it. Make sure you do it in order. This is an absolutely cool event that they do each year, and I think it's great. I don't know if they're gonna do it much after Diablo 4, guys, but make sure you get this. You have until the end of the month to get it, and I showed you exactly how to do it and where everything is at. So make sure you get your Royal Craft. Uh, your royal calf pet and make sure you can go back to the blacksmith and craft your words leg anytime you want so you have it for nostalgia but that is how you do it guys like this video if it has helped you out make sure you comment below and let me know if you got your royal calf in season 27 of diablo and as always stay gaming i'll catch you guys in the next one peace